today I have with me the Miss Maid. Thank you for taking your time to be interviewed. Tell us a bit about yourselves. We've been together for like two years now. Yep. Um, we are a hard rock band. We play nationally and internationally. <coughs> we have just released a film clip and another single. Next year, 2017, we're going over to play at the Rebellion Festival in, in uh, England. You're from another band, is that right? Us, we're all from different bands. So I was in Night Cruise, Jess was in Bitch Slap, Nettie's been in the Dark Shadows and another band that we had together called Fireflies. Rexy's been in countless bands as well. Okay. So yeah. Jess and I knew each other when we were young. Our bands played together. And yeah, we just sort of it sort of just converged on each other and here we are. This year, twenty sixteen, has been I think quite a big year for you. Yeah. It's been massive. Well yeah, now, we've had a very good couple of months. So it yeah. seems like we had a shitful beginning and then it got better and then we got to play with L7 and we went to the awards and we got Rebellion and now we're on tour again and yeah. So The awards is the Australian Independent Music Awards that we went to the other week. We were um, nominated for that, so that was really cool. Did you win? Nah. We didn't win. Don't put we weren't nominated. We were, <laughs> yeah, we, were finalists. Finalists. No, we were finalists. Your music clips, like how you make good clips, but how do you like get the ideas to make scenes and you know, tell us about the creative process of you guys making um, um, well, we usually come up with the idea, and we're very lucky to have a friend of ours, Ash, who's fucking phenomenal at doing film clips. So there's that. We work together. We try to use the location more than <coughs> scenes because we don't have a lot of money, and long storyboard clips tend to cost more and take a lot longer, and then you have to get other people involved and stuff. But yeah, I don't know. We so just I think for Blood Money, which was our last clip, you really came up with the concept of it and you took it to Ash, didn't you? And the two of yeah, you yeah. But when that the... kind of was weird because we everything we wanted to do didn't work out. We originally wanted to do it at Magic Kingdom, but Magic Kingdom was underwater. Mm. So a friend of ours suggested the tunnel and it turned out really good. It was really good. We went to the, Helensburg, the, leeches and... the Helensburg abandoned train tunnel. Yeah. And there were leeches and lots and lots of mud, but it was yeah. totally. And really our cool. friend Glenn had a, played a pretty big part in that too with the makeup because we couldn't afford makeup and the makeup artists we usually use couldn't be there. So he suggested doing the the cuts and shit because that's what he does. Kind of like does zombie super train wreck makeup, special like effect. slashes down our face and blood yeah. and yeah. I mean, you're making a debt album, which is the new album that's coming out next year. Yeah. Probably around June, I think. But I think we're going to probably release it overseas first. So what are the goals of this band? Our goals are just more gigs, more tours, <laughs> more songs, more albums. Don't get arrested. Don't get arrested. <laughs> come, don't come home in a body bag. Tell us a really interesting story on touring. Oh, okay. Sounds pretty full on. We had a good story. We did a gig in Berlin and then we went to this little German bar afterwards and um, we stayed there. Basically they shut drank the whole bar and we drank the whole bar dry. We left at 8.30 in the morning because she ran out of alcohol. Like, we were helping ourselves behind the bar, like making our own cocktails. And mm. Went upstairs to get food from the buffet and the Russian lady who ran the hotel hated us. She thought we were... Told us to get out! She thought we were junkies off the street <laughs> or something <laughs> because we're there at 8.30 in the morning. Trying going, to eat cucumber. <laughs> You we realised it just make it through Manchester <laughs> customs. Oh, right? yeah, we got drug tested through, through plane. Manchester. Was, they took everything in my bag out. And they they even scanned. I had a packet of chips, and they yeah. scanned my chips. Yeah, and I was crazy. like, "It's yeah. a colossal bag." What was it like opening for L7 this year? Oh, it was like a dream come true, basically. Yeah, it was amazing. Yeah. It was excellent. And how did you get to open? Like who? Contacted who or how does it? I tell you that will have to kill you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just we yeah. we literally just did what every other band would do, and we, we yeah, applied for it. The touring company contacted them. We put in for it, it and we yeah. pursued it. I guess. What other bands would you like to open for? Um, what would we like to open for? Oh, refused. Yeah. Refused. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Silent Woo. For everyone in Sydney and all over Europe and internationally, how can we see your shows? Go yeah. to our page, The Miss Maid, on Facebook, yeah. or www.themissmaid.com, and that has links to everything. Yeah.